Hey guys, so it's half time in the Hawthorne versus Port Adelaide AFL game and as you can see it's been pretty interesting at least from a match betting perspective. So in the first quarter Hawthorne won 25-0 um, which was great for us because as you can see over here uh, we've got $100 on Hawthorne at Sportsbet and because they were up by 12 points at the end of the quarter uh, we've received this early payout. So we're already guaranteed $176 in our account at Sportsbet. In fact, it should be there already. Then early in the second quarter, Hawthorne scored again and that put them 32 points ahead. Um, and because of that, we got the early payout at Bet365 because they were leading by 30. Since then, Port Adelaide have made a slight comeback is it's now 38 to 15. If we go over to Betfair, we can see that Hawthorne are still huge favourites, uh, and I fully expect that they're going to win this game. So we've got a couple of options. We can either wait for, wait for and hope for Port Adelaide to come back, in which case we would get the double payout, uh, or we can lock in some profit using the early payout calculator. Now, the way the early payout calculator is set up is is designed for backing and laying pre-match now i've already done a video showing how you can use it with uh, a dutching example um, but i'm going to do another one here because this one we've got multiple multiple bookies involved uh, so the first thing that we need to do is we need to set up the the positions box here we want to get these outcomes to match our outcomes from the plays um, and you can see here, because we've got the, the advantage of having this bet easy cash bonus, this double winnings offer, um, we've actually got a break even situation on Hawthorne, so that's going to make our life pretty easy here. Uh, we would have a 27.90 loss on Port Adelaide, but we would get that cash bonus, so really our loss is $2.40 if Port Adelaide win. Uh, for the, the back section, in this part, we want to put in the back odds and the back stake of the early payout that we're going to receive or have received. Now, because we've got two, so we've got $150 of stake, so that's what I'm going to put in here. Uh, the odds are slightly different between the two bookies, so we've got 1.76 at Sportsbet, 1.78 at Bet365. So obviously the, the medium between them would be 1.77, but because we've got a little bit more on sports bet, uh, I'm actually going to put in 1.76. Oh, sorry, 1.766. With this calculator, you can go to as many decimal places as you want. Uh, we don't have to be super accurate with this. Uh, you can be OCD about it and try and get exact amounts, or you can just get it roughly... Uh, at what the figures you've got on the, the plays. So for the lay odds, I'm also going to put in 1.766. And you can see, if I leave the commission blank, that's going to give me a back position of zero, which is exactly what I've got here. And then, as I said, this Port Adelaide, when you factor in bet easy, is really a loss of $2.40. I could play around with the early payout calculator if I wanted and try and get that. But it's really not that important. I'm just going to leave it at zero on both sides. That's, that's close enough for me at the moment. Next step would be to come down and mark the early payout box to yes. And then I'm going to take the back odds of 1.13 from Betfair and put them in here. 1.13. And you can see now that I can potentially lock in $30 uh, and 48 cents now. Because we do have that 240 loss on Port Adelaide, this would actually be $28 if um, Port Adelaide were to win and $30 if Hawthorne were to win. Um, and we can play around with the, the slider here to, to see the different potential amounts. Um, but if I want even on both, both outcomes, with the exception of that 240, I would back $234.42 on Betfair. So uh, you will need to do this over the phone or with a VPN. So by backing $234.42, I would be getting roughly 
on on both potential outcomes. Now, do you know, some may, people might want to do that. If you think Port Adelaide have got no chance in this game, then that's thirty dollars that you can walk in. Uh, but the other thing that you could do is wait and see. Maybe they come out in the second half and they score the first two goals, and this becomes thirty eight twenty seven. That becomes a lot more interesting, and maybe you're going to get one point three, one point four, maybe one point five on on Betfair. And once you get up to those numbers, your potential lock-in profit is going to go up a lot. So it'll be up to you what the level it has to get to for you to, to cash out would be. Uh, or you can just wait and, and hope for the full double payout if Port Adelaide were to win. Uh, but that's just an example of how you would use the calculator in the middle of a game when you've got a, a Dutch, whether it's through the plays or through your own bets that you've put on. Uh, so yeah, if anyone's got any questions, let me know. But hopefully that makes it a little bit clearer on how you would uh, use this calculator to walk in. Cheers.